So for today, we're going to be looking at these seasonal challenges for week eight. If you guys don't know, we usually look at the challenges for the week and Eververse just to see what she's offering. So that way, if you guys are away from your screen, you guys can get an idea of what to do when you guys get home. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. I really do appreciate it. I like I actually do. I don't say this just to say it. I really do appreciate all of the comments. I read them all. I I reply to all of them. I have that ability yet still. So really, really appreciate it. Other than that, let's get into it. So let's start off with the first one, Light of the Righteous, Complete Mission Retribution. I haven't done this one yet, obviously, and I have not even seen anything of it. So I'm kind of excited for it because it's a new mission and we're like deep into the season. So hopefully it's something something super, super cool or at least gives us some good rewards. Again, I've not seen anything of it, so I'm hoping we get some cool things. But the actual realist inside me is like, don't expect anything. It's probably going to be trash. Uh, size define defeat champions or bosses in defined battleground playlist bonus progress awarded for those defeated on legend difficulty uh yeah not hard just just to uh, play the game forehead uh trial by firing squad win multiple rounds in trials of osiris this one's not gonna be hard for me because i play trials of osiris occasionally um and actually with the new ma uh, team matchmaking thing i love it so i'm probably gonna get this one as soon as uh trials is up Relentless Liberator, gain bonus rewards using a Defiant key at the end of Defiant play, uh, Battlegrounds playlist activities on both normal and legend difficulties. Defiant keys can be, uh, we already know how to do that. Rewards earned through the Bestian Ward upgrade at the war table will, will provide additional progress. So bonus rewards received three. So basically three, run three of them, I think. That shouldn't be hard considering, well, I mean, not hard, but like, do you really want to run another Battlegrounds uh, Defiant one? I don't know. We have Defiant Gambit Ornament, acquire the Gambit Ornament for Ecliptic, Ecliptic Distaff, which is cool, um, not hard. I mean, so for some people it is considering it's Gambit, but for me, I don't mind it. Uh, Gambit's not that crazy. And then Calibrate Swords, Bows, and Glaives, bonus progress for defeating Guardians. That's pretty funny considering there's another one that we have to do that for um, somewhere around here. Yeah, that one, Razor's Edge. So that's pretty hilarious. This isn't Gambit though, but this one didn't specify where, so I feel like you should be fine doing it in Gambit. So that's pretty much it for this week. Uh, nothing too crazy. I need to like really pick up on doing some of these because I need to get the seasonal thing or more bright dust. But let's actually check out this. Uh, all right. Uh, that's right. Let's make it a video. <laughs> uh as for eververse sorry i went to go poop uh you don't need to know that as for eververse grayscale undergrowth this is the shader that they're um you know um i want to say skip this but i know there's someone out there who's gonna be like bro this is such a good shader what are you talking about and you know uh i just got off work and i'm really tired so you know what this is a dub get it um time honored shader as well is actually i don't like the shader either and the person who i'm afraid of probably would agree with me i'm not a big fan of it that being said i did use the time honored shader for the cloak for the uh celestial nighthawk build with this look with this ornament that mean i mean uh sorry again i just got off work i'm tired um yeah i ended up using it for the cloak so i mean there that is we have lattice entrance. I didn't even press. I, I didn't mean to press. Damn, that looks cool, actually. Mm. For 450, you can eat my ass. Uh, Lucid Dream, which is. Oh, that's cool. Ooh, I kind of want to get this. Oh, mm. okay. I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave. Uh, we have quick cardio. And at the bottom, we have side eye projection. We have Whaler's Whim. Damn, this is cool. Ooh, I kind of want to get it. I might get this. Uh, Gilded Prowler, which is, is it, it's a ship. It looks weird. Um, Yeah, I mean, I fuck with it. We have Sweeper Simulant. <laughs> that's a funny name, Sweeper Simulant. Uh, that's funny. Uh, it's a pretty funny one. Uh, I definitely wouldn't get it though. We have Sweeper Shell, which is, yeah. And then we have the chess pieces for the casual set. If you guys don't know, I've already made the video for that. It's right here. You guys can check it out. I've also already made the individual pieces for all the classes. So if you guys are picking this up right now, check those videos out. If you want to see some inspiration from them, um, we have the touch grass one, which I am actually tempted to get because uh, one of my friends has this and I would like to have this. I don't know. We'll see. We have up in smoke. 
We have Box of Tricks, Reef Awoken. I like that one. And for the shaders, we have Whispered Sheen. I have already reviewed this shader. You can check it out right here. It's a really in-depth uh, review, more in-depth than usual. And I definitely recommend this shader. It's really, really cool. You guys will see that it has this really cool, uh, like wood texture, which is super, super cool, but also has this really good gold. The off color will be like this really like bright, uh, chrome green. I shouldn't say bright, but it's like really like green. So just be aware of that. We have shattered sinew, which is a really good red and white shader. Definitely super dope. Definitely pick it up as well. Also, you guys can see right here that it's, uh, silver or yeah, silver, I guess. Super dope. Definitely picked that one up. Uh, Polished Sea Stone. This is a turd. I don't like this one at all. Uh, definitely gives me Buzz Lightyear vibes. And then Iridescent Coral, which is a really cool shader. Definitely want to use this a lot more because it is really, really cool. So let me know what you guys think. Um, pretty excited to do some stuff in Destiny 2 considering we have a new mission. Um... I think that's really it actually i don't i'm not really too big on anything right now i've been currently playing um oh, uh, not overwatch uh world of warcraft that's what i was gonna say i've been playing world of warcraft uh final fantasy 14 a lot more and then um warframe specifically because i want to make a video on this but i'll just give you uh some little patch notes i guess uh starting this year which i mean we're already in this year but Starting probably next month, maybe we'll see. I will start posting non Destiny 2 fashion because I kind of want to position myself as the fashion person in gaming because I like a fa I like a lot of the fashion in games. I think it's super dope. Like I even do it with uh, like the from software games. I do that quite a bit. Like I mix and match and try to look cool. Um, and yeah, I do that a lot for a lot of games. Like specifically, this all started from. Uh, borderlands 2 if you guys don't know borderlands 2 had like helmets and uh different shaders i guess you would say and yeah i that's where it all started where i just wanted to look cool and then it destiny 2 kind of well i shouldn't say destiny 2 because technically it was uh final fantasy 14 final fantasy 14 actually started before destiny 2 or destiny 1 i mean but yeah i'm gonna be i'm gonna try to post some more stuff that's not destiny 2 related but don't worry that doesn't mean that Oh, Tony's not going to do Destiny 2 anymore. I'm actually going to be doing like a majority of my content will still be Destiny 2, but I will like sprinkle some non Destiny 2 content in there. And then hopefully at one point it will be like a combination of a bunch of content that's just fashion related. So if you guys like fashion and gaming, let me know in the comments below if this is something you would uh, be liking. But other than that, be safe and I'll see you guys later.